Good morning, dear hearts. We're at lesson 268, and, uh, and we are coming close to the completion of this section and on to the next one. Woohoo! Okay, lesson 268. Let all things be exactly as they are. The first thing we have to realize with this lesson is that this isn't the real world. This world, this experience that we are walking around in is not the real world. You know, way back when, because I'm always going to say that, in the first part of the workbook, there were a few lessons that spoke to this and you were giving us the hints along the way, one of which is there's another way to look at the world. Um, and that I have invented the world I see, that this isn't real. So we're, we've been told this for quite some time. But again, the lesson that is imbued in this lesson, as in every lesson truly, is I am as God created me. And this lesson is no exception. Um, but let's go. So this is not the real world. And what I look upon is what I believe is real because I don't see truly what is real. But today, just for today, I will not make things up. This is really my declaration for this lesson. I'm not going to make things up today and I'm not going to try to change anything. I am as God created me and so is everything else. So every time I look on something in this world, I will realize I've invented it, it's not real, and I will turn away from it. Every time I see pain, I see fear, I see anxiety, I see suffering, any, any type of fear, because those are all fears, all right? They're just, we give fear multiple, multiple names and characteristics. Um, so whenever I see that, I am going to step away from it. I'm going to step away, put up my hands. Remember, hold on to nothing. Step away from this world as I see it, and I will go quietly into the heart of God where perfection and quiet and love abide and that's that is where I am truly at home and I will let everything everything be exactly as it is today I will not try to change anything I see in this world and I will let everything be at one and in unity within the heart of God in what is true in what is real, with a capital R. I'll change nothing today. I will be quiet, I will be calm, and I will connect with the one-mindedness of my Father. And that's it. So, um, the last line says, our reality is wholly safe, and it is only this we seek today. And that kind of wraps up everything. Okay, um, I hope this helped. Please like, please share, please subscribe, please comment. Um, we're now at 101 subscribers. Again, I'm gobsmacked and very, very, very grateful. Uh, be well and be here tomorrow. Namaste.